Well, still no word on any suspects in an Aurora Park shooting that injured six teenagers. All of them attended Aurora Central High School and they are expected to recover. Witnesses say they heard a large number of shots fired and the police chief says they found different size of shell casings. CBS 4 Shauna Kalafi joins us from Aurora. Shauna, there's really growing concern from this community about violence involving teens. Yeah, there is, Dom, and because of that, several community leaders met today to discuss outreach efforts in response to that shooting, including a march that would end here at Nome Park, where those six teens were shot yesterday. That's been planned for this Friday. They're still working out the logistics and securing any necessary permits, but the group is planning to meet at Kenton Elementary this Friday at 3, and then they'll march down Juliet to 11th to Aurora Central and ending at Nome Park around 5. During that meeting this morning, a few people did bring up safety concerns since the shooter is still on the loose. So they are considering having a police presence at that march as well. Right now, those community organizations are visiting six different schools around where that shooting happened. They're talking to students about the resources available to them. And they're also planning a community outreach event for this Saturday. We're just trying to figure a way uh, to get to these youth that are lost, that are depressed, that are angry, that have self-hatred and trying to build self-love back in them. And community leaders are hoping that ending that march here at Nome Park on Friday will start to shift the negative perspective that many in this community have of this park. They're also encouraging anyone with information about the shooting to come forward. In Aurora, Shauna Kalafi covering Colorado First. Shauna, thank you. Well, we have seen massive security.